this is going to be the cytoplasm. These are going to be the vacuoles. This is the mitochondria. And then this is the cell membrane. Gotta wash this. I forgot the chromosomes. Where are they at? Oh. <laughs> and these are the chromosomes. And this is what it will look like eventually. Okay. Now I'm going to make this one. Then after that, I'm gonna. Oh, why did I do this? One? Cut up my vacuoles. Now the pizzas are ready and John go look at them. Mom I'm recording mom. They're done. Where are they? I no not yet. Oh. I'll just show them there. Oh. Da -da -da -da. Can you So that is our cell with the nucleus, cytoplasm, vacuoles, mitochondria, cytoplasm, and cell membrane. Yay! You said cytoplasm twice instead of cro chromosomes. Oh, no, those are the chromosomes. Oh! Wah! Good? This is the second part of my two-part project, which is first part making a cell model out of pizza and the second part is going around my house finding things that function the same as certain cell organelles in the animal cell and for the cell membrane I picked my door I picked my door because my door can keep out anything that doesn't have hands or isn't, isn't strong enough to open a door but the cell membrane can keep out anything that's not strong enough to eat away or you know get into the cell so there you go Okay, so the thing that I decided was like a nucleus in an animal cell is a light switch. Because a light switch, as soon as you turn it, flip the switch, the light comes on. And as soon as the nucleus tells an organelle to do something, say flip the switch, it does it. So I'm going to go over here to my light switch. No. What? Same thing over here. I turn this light off. What? And that is the nucleus light switch relation example in a cell. Okay, this is my vacuole part of my two-part project of things around the house that work the same as cell organelles. 
And for the vacuole, I picked a humidifier because a humidifier has a tank, and then the vacuole has, you know, a pouch where it keeps the water, same as the tank and the humidifier, and the vacuole collects all the bad stuff and spits it out, and the humidifier collects all the water, creates it into humidity, and spits it out. And the humidifier right here, this is the tank where all the bad stuff would collect in the vacuole, and then there's where it spits it out. You can kind of see the smoke right there. But there you go, there's the vacuole part of my second part of my two-part project. Okay, so for my mitochondria section of this video, I put batteries and a charger because as mitochondria is the powerhouse to the cell, batteries and chargers are powerhouses to electronics. And that was my mitochondria section of my second part of my two-part video about cells. the same no matter time no place they don't understand that us kids are going to make some mistakes so to you other kids all across the land there's no need to argue parents.